Yuck. 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 <laughs> Why is there only one directly in front of him though? Like I understand this is like this is like kawaii kind of cute, but then what is that front one doing and why is it curving though? To be honest, y'all, I was I, I was opening the game and I was like, "Damn, we really, we, we we really playing a game where I gotta talk the entire time, right? I gotta read everybody's sentences, different voice, different voice changers, because you know we gotta do sans. Obviously, we gotta get sans voice in there. Then we got hey, hey. <laughs> and then like I'm sitting here thinking to myself, like, dang, like I'm gonna be tired by the end of this. Like, like where am I gonna get the energy to start? You know what I mean? It's in the music. I finish dancing, I look at the screen. Why is Flowey on my shit? What? Good job, welcome back. Hey, to another episode of The Undertale, episode number four. We already know, Undyne might be a slimmy up underneath all that armor. We saw Lil Bro getting mad at me. Let's see where this goes next. Oh my gosh, and then we got him going like this on me, two facing it on me. Are you good or bad? Why Why is he trying to press me? Bro, I'm here to help you out. When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. Okay, let's put these bridge seeds in the water real quick. Yep. Man, I did it the wrong way. I need a restart. I need a restart. This dude need a sprint key. Like he's just walking nonchalantly like he's not getting pressed by baby dinosaurs. Jack Skellington and his little bro Mario. Like, you can't tell me Sans ain't built like Mario. Ugh. All right, now we got a little bit of Minecraft action going. The soundtrack to this game, Toby Fox. You did your thing with this one. Okay, what's up with you? Aaron flexes in. Aaron. This look like... Look like a buff radish. Come on in, the water's fine. Waves. Okay. 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 I'm not gonna lie. Playing games like this make me think like, man, can you make a game real easy? Do you have it in you? No, you don't even finish them. You didn't even finish playing them. This seahorse has a lot of HP, horsepower. And you know what? I'm gonna just, all of his attacks are harder to dodge at the bottom of the box. Check all you want. And I'm going up. Oh my gosh, what is he doing? Drooling on me, dripping on me, pause, pause, pause. He got drip a little, look at his hair, he's cool. And Aaron is admiring his own. Man, I'm gonna flex back at him. You flex, Aaron flexes twice as hard. Attack increases for you, for you. <laughs> attack increases for you too. Okay, so we both get a uh, attack increase. Flexing contest, okay, flex more. This is too easy, oh my gosh. Aaron is ready for your next flex. I'm gonna flex again. He flex harder. Aaron flexes thrice as hard. Attack increases for you too. Nice! I won't lose though. Bro, my character does not hit any type of weights. He's not buff. He don't even do push-ups. And that mess really hit me harder. Aaron is ready for your next flex. I gotta keep going. I gotta win over his, his flex respect. Aaron flexes very hard. He flexes himself out of the room. Let's go. You won. You earned zero XP and 10 gold. I spend gold on items like, like basicles, bro. I need my, um, yep. Give me some of these so I can read the note. Yep. You already know the deal. I'm in here. I'm a gamer, bro. You thought I wasn't gonna game? Come on. Yep. Yep. Just go ahead and throw that down. Okay. Whatever. Maybe go over here. Nice. 
We got to connect four. You know, I'm going to get in the mix again before this four ends. It is what it is. I'm a gamer. I do this. I came here to fight. Matter of fact, I don't even know why I came here. I accidentally tripped. But that's life. Sometimes you got to chip yourself into the next chapter. Uh, let me in. Congratulations. You failed the puzzle. Yo, Toby, are you all right, bro? Ain't nobody needs you to tell me that. If an error is made, the bell blossom can call bridge seeds back to where they started. If I drop, oh yeah, 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 that's it right there. Yep, because I can, I didn't even, I thought it was gonna go down because the waterfall's coming down, you know, but he but he, he throws them. Nope, I need, I need those back, sir. Thank you. Maybe I, maybe I can do something like this. They're touching. They're touching. Grow. Great. I know. I know you can't throw them off the brick. Oh, yes, you can. Oh, yes, you can. We in the pocket. We in the pocket. Let's go. Uh, back on back on his mission. Back on his grind. Doing what he got to do. Avoiding all talking flowers like Sam warned us. Move. I'm in there. Who got my number? Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? Cause you're a creep. I didn't even give Sans my number. Hold on, hold on, hold on. When I was at your house, did you go through my? Sh when did I? When, when? When would I have been vulnerable to that? Maybe in the mix of that fight. Now that I'm sitting there thinking about it, when we was fighting, he was getting undressed. What are you doing, bro? I told you no. Like he, he's showing me his jersey, bro. Keep your armor on. It was easy. I just dialed every number set. I just dialed every number sequen sequentially. Is that the word? I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. <laughs> so. What are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. Hang up on him. Uh, Hang up on him now, bro. He doesn't understand boundaries. She thought she saw you wearing a bandana. Is that true? Are you wearing a bandana? What will you say? I don't even... Am I wearing the manly bandana? Yeah, I'm wearing it. Hold on, because Sans warned us. Sans warned us when we was eating fries up at Gibby's, remember? He said there's a flower stalking papyrus, whispering sweet nothings in his ears. Um... No, because that's going to validate her, her stalking me. No. So you aren't wearing a bandana. I just lied to this dude. I have to. Got it. You're my friend. So I trust you 100%. Have a nice day. Click. And he hangs up. Am I wearing one? No, I, I can't remember. Manly bandana. I'm wearing one, bro. Who's watching me? A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you hoped with all of your heart, your wish would come true. Now, all we have are these sparkling stones on the ceiling. Wishing room. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. Okay, all right. Come on, sis, make a wish. So maybe it is a girl. Hold on though. Washua shuffles up. Okay, Washua. And it's a washing machine with a little duck and a face for a fist. What kind of setup is this? Eagle claw feet. Check him out first. He do look wild. This humble germaphobe seeks to cleanse the whole world. Tweet. Your soul is unclean. Yuck. Okay, good move. How do you dodge this? There you go. Easy work. Washa was friends with a little bird. Tweet at him. That bird don't know. Um, clean yourself. Yep. You ask Washua to clean you. It hops around excitedly. Green means clean. Golly! Washua was thrown to the, okay. Oh, that means I can dip. Yup, oh, I'm gone. He would hit me one more time? Lights out, bro, lights out. I don't care if the duck isn't involved. That's what y'all don't understand, bro. Sometimes they all gotta just get casualtied on. I wish my sister and I will see the real stars someday. I was watching this one video on YouTube. Look through the telescope. Yeah, absolutely. 
check wall. Okay. I'm going to check the wall. I'm going to check the wall. I was watching this video on YouTube, just a little sidebar real quick. And it was talking about the idea of wasting time, right? And it was like one of those motivational videos with the speech over like all the cool superhero clips, famous movie clips, etc. The idea is that you're surrounded on your deathbed around all the things that you should have done during your time here, but you didn't, right? And so they're all pleading around you. Why? We came to you. We chose you to act us out and you did not And now we're going to die with you. So, you know, just live it up. Do what you got to do. I don't even understand this wishing room yet, but that, but that just came to my mind. So I just wanted to share that with y'all. You know, it's important. And just like that, the wall pooted and boo-booed. And now we walking inside of it. Wow. It's nasty. Okay. All right. Ancient writings cover the walls. You can just make out the words. The war of humans and monsters. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would take the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the, pow the power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist outside the human body, even after death. Interesting. If a monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul? A horrible beast with unfathomable power. It's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. Now, there was an area we could walk to the left. I'm going to check this out real quick, and then we're going to continue. And there's nothing I can do there, so we're just going to continue. I feel like we may be leading up to... Possibly the entrance to the castle. Okay. Okay. On a little bit of Aladdin Agrabah Ag 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 action. There we go. Alliteration. Here we go. We knew it. Whoa! Oh, like that? That's how you feel? If it's a blue attack, can I stop it? No, I'm finna leave, bro. Screw you. I was, I was trying to meet you. I had a little homie who was interested in you, but you suck. You can't even land an attack on me. I'm finna blitz through your whole stage. Get mixed. Oh, good move. Whoa. Okay, you're wildin' right now. My name is Uh. You don't even know me, dude. What did you do? Oh, I'm back in the cornfield? Nope, you wish. You wish. Dino Kid. Dino Kid. Where did Dino Kid go? Did you find me? <laughs> I knew you. I knew he. I knew he was in here. Look how happy he is to get grabbed by the ball. The eyeball that is. Is this me? Where is Bro at in here? Just come out, bro, and talk to me, bro. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yo. Did you see that? <laughs> Undying? Just touch me! <laughs> I gotta drink I gotta drink some water. I'm looking at my OBS screen right here. It says go live notification. It's time for the game awards. It's been that long since I streamed. Oh my gosh. Just know I'm in the middle of a move. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to move about this crib to my own crib. And uh, because of that, I put a lot of things postponed. You know what I'm saying? To really get going probably like March. I know a lot of people may not see this message in the middle of the video. You know what I mean? But I just wanted you to know, dedicated, faithful, loving viewer that you are. You know, that's for you. Um, Regularly scheduled programming, probably like March, you know, February, January was a break for me. So if you enjoyed the amount of content in January and like you're satisfied, I love you. You know what I mean? But just know uh, further, further on for the rest of the year, I'm never washing my face ever again. <laughs> Man, are you unlucky. If you were standing just a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. <laughs> I'm sure we'll see you again. <laughs> <laughs>
you know uh dino kid is a poise fan bro you know he loved poise bro you can't act like that and not love poise this cheese has been here so long a magical crystal has grown over it it's stuck to the table that is not crystal bro that is a living breathing organism sent here to kill you squeak listening to the rat knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the mystical crystal it fills you with determination had i known in that room with the um with the petals that grow in the water would have led me to the right path i would have went down and around and like looked around some more so you know i'm thinking about getting into the telescope business it's normally 50,000 G's to use this premium telescope. But since I know you, you can use it for free. That was about it. Yeah, I'm gonna use the telescope because I got a message in it last time. All right, here we go. Just scanning, 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 scanning. Yep. Yeah, I'm doing like like a little bit of a broom motion, like a little bit of a sweep motion, broom motion. Huh? You aren't satisfied. Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. <laughs> Did you see my eye bruised up? Hold on. Oh, she really she really decked me in my Good move, good move. I know I said that I wasn't gonna attack anybody or, or no, I didn't even say that. So next time I see Undyne, she getting pieced up, bro. I, honestly, I, I I I didn't attack her so she can chill, but finally a protective piece of armor. Defense seven, I'm gonna put that two to one. All right, let's get going. Okay, we got a drip, drip drop of vanilla talking. <clears throat> What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? Don't talk to me. Just like that you ruined a what could have been a cool friend because you wanted to be a weirdo. You hear a passing conversation. So don't you have any wishes to make? Hmm, just one, but it's kind of stupid. Why do I feel like this is Papyrus? This is Papyrus's message. Oh my gosh, that scared me. Just, just what are you doing here? What are you doing here? You have no business being out here. Feels like a hiding spot. Maybe, maybe not. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? You're carrying too much. The bicycle was thrown. Yep, yeah, yeah. The bicycle was thrown away. Yep, take these. I feel like if I mix the, if I mix the two, these used shoes make you feel incredibly dangerous. I got the two, two, and the matching ballet shoes. I'm on. That should give me like some crazy cartwheel trick or something, bro. Like my agility goes up by like 50 or something. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very uh, murdery. Well, worry not, dear human. Papyrus would never betray you. You said you're not wearing a bandana. So of course I actually told her you were indeed wearing a bandana. What's going on right now? It pained me to tell such a bold faced lie. But since you aren't wearing a bandana, she surely won't attack you. Now you are safe and sound. Maui, this is hard. I just want to be everybody's friend. And he hangs up. Papyrus, that's impossible, bro. Not everybody's gonna love you. If you being your true self, bro, somebody's gonna, gonna get tired of it. It is what it is, bro. We're all annoying to somebody, dude. Okay, so bro wants me to flex. I'm not about to sit here and flex with him this whole time. Matter of fact, I'm gonna shoot him and tell him to go flex on somebody else, man. You tell Aaron to go away. 
feisty, huh? Oh my gosh. All right, well, I know how to get rid of Washua, bro. Washua. I didn't even care what bro was talking about. Bro, yo, go ahead and yep, hit me with some with some uh, soap and suds, you know what I mean? Green means clean. Where the green at? Over here. Easy work. Aaron is sweating bullets. Yep, thank you. Bro, I don't want to have to sit here and flex with you, bro. It's just weird. All right, uh, I guess we have no choice. Let's go. At least when I spare people, I get some kind of some kind of monetaries. You know, even if the money isn't used for much besides heels, but it is what it is. You hear a passing conversation. Don't say that. Come on. I promise I won't laugh. I don't know whose voice that is at this point. I mean, Papyrus did call me the power to take their souls. This is the power that humans feared. Yuck, yuck, yuck. And it's following me now and it's trying to stalk me. I'm standing still. It's intimidated me. <laughs> what voice is this? Hey there. <laughs> Notice you were here. Why is there only one directly in front of him though? Like I understand this is like, this is like kawaii kind of cute. But then what is that front one doing? And why is it curving though? I'm onion son. Onion son, you hear? All right. Go. You're visiting waterfall, huh? <laughs> it's great here, huh? You love it, huh? <laughs> yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. All right, that's enough. Leave me alone. Even though the water is getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time, but hey, hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium like all my friends did. That's a sad face. He's heard about that. He's heard about that. He, he wants his friends back. And the aquarium's full anyway, so even if I wanted to, I... That's okay, though, you hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? You ever meet people like this? Like, how come they don't get a clue that you're trying to leave them? What part of their brain is turned off to that? I don't understand. It's like, bro, I'm doing all the obvious signs, like, right before cussing you out. And you don't see any of them. Hey there. That's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In waterfall. He wasn't that bad. You should have he should have explained that was his his hand tentacle. That's all I'm saying. Let me know it's your hand, bro. Shiren hides in the corner, but somehow encounters you anyway. Talk about it. What do you? What is? What's the deal with you? You need a bonnet, bro. Look at your hair, Sh Shiren. Tone deaf. She's too ashamed to sing her deadly song. Um, um, um. Oh, so she's turned around. Is that homie? Shiren thinks about doing karaoke by herself. I'm a hum, like, like, come on, hmm, do, 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 do. You hum a sad song. Shiren follows your melody. Look at her turned around and gaze with me now. Siren, Siren. Whoa! Hey, 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 I don't like that song. I don't like that song. Shiren seems much more comfortable singing along. Oh, she good, she good. Oh, I want to see what else she do. You smile. You ask to see Shiren smile too. Shiren gets quieter in the corner. Aaron nods his head approvingly. Cyrus. Relax, relax, stop, 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 chill, chill. 
Shiren seems much more comfortable singing along. You wave your arms wildly. You are now vulnerable to electric attacks. She is belting it. You go ahead, Shiren. You go ahead and sing your song. Matter of fact, let's keep humming with her. Monsters are drawn to the music. Suddenly, it's a concert. See fa, see fa, so fi, so mi, mi, mi. There you go, Shiren. Sing your shit. Hey! Sans is selling tickets made of toilet paper. That man, stay awesome. We're not done yet. You hum some more. The seats are sold out. You feel like a rock star. Son, stay trying to come up off my work, bro. The crowd tosses clothing. It's a storm of socks. You hum some more, but the constant attention, the tours, the groupies, it's all aggressive tooting. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Shiren thinks about her future. You and Shiren have come so far, but it's time. You both have your own journeys to embark on. You hum a farewell song. The final two. Oh, it hurt! <laughs> oh my gosh. Now we sell merch. Get your Shiren dolls at easygang.com. All right, moving on. The northern room hides a great treasure. Okay, well. This power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears, and an incredible power will be needed to take the soul of a living monster. Bro, we going up here and getting this power because I feel like it's about to turn up on me in a minute. Oh, what is this? A little Grand Theft Auto? There's a piano here. Left down. Yeah, I'm going to play it. Hold on, hold on. Dang it, I had it. A haunting song echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. I'm cool on that. I'm cool. I'm cool. Now this is now this is what I'm here for. It's a statue. The structures at its feet seem dirty. All right. A little bit of a shrine. Please take one. All right. A little bit of an umbrella. Absolutely. Thank you. You took an umbrella. Absolutely. I appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, I see the need for an umbrella. This looks like a giant goose, but it's reflective. Big puddles. And here go my guy. Yo! You got an umbrella? <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Why didn't you get an umbrella yourself? You're not even standing under it, bro. Matter of fact, I'm about to take him back through here and see if we can bust open this uh, hallway. That big old noggin he got. I feel this pain. Yo, I already looked. I'm dying. It's not over here. <laughs> so I guess I'll see you later. <laughs> this dude is in love with Undyne. Bring your little, bring your little um lemon head ass up. Look at his eyes, bro. Like you need to get some rest, bro. If I knew who your parents was, I would have been called him on a celly and told him to come pick you up, dude. Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats her bad guys and never loses. <laughs> if I was a human, I'd whip the bed every night. <laughs> Knowing she was going to beat me up. <laughs> so bro said Undyne beats up bad people. Undyne got the game twisted, bro. I'm not bad. So, one time, <laughs> we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower, right? <laughs> The king. We had to call him Mr. Dreamer. <laughs> Volunteered to donate his own flowers. 
He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. <laughs> that got me thinking. <sighs> Yo! How cool would it be if Undyne came to school? Now think about it, bro. Think about it, bro. Now before you answer, think about it, bro. She can beat up all the teachers. <laughs> Undyne is the shit, man. Who taught him how to cuss? Um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. Uh, she's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. My bad, I got the mur mouse cursor all in the way. Oh, we get our first cutscene? Oh, okay, we still game playing. Okay, that's cool. Even in 8-bit, you can tell, like, the scale of this world is just... It's just dense. Yo, why are you stopping? Yuck. Even this, it's like, bro, genius. Return the umbrella, absolutely. I see you, Toby. I see you, bro. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, you want to see Undyne, right? Climb on my shoulders. <laughs> Look at him squatting the helper, bro. Yo, you going ahead. Don't worry about me, man. <laughs> I always find a way to get through. <laughs> See ya, bro. I love you. I love you too, man. You didn't have to sneak here, bro. I love you. So what? It's love. Share it. Spread it. Let the world need more of it. Oh, it's cool. The sound of muffled rain on the cave top. It fills you with determination. And for all the gang bangers who watch my videos, I'm just, I'm just copying Blueface. I ain't part of no gang, no affiliation. The humans, afraid of a uh, easy gang, though. No. What's up with you? What's up? The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful and us monsters too weak. But a single soul was taken and countless monsters returned to dust. All right. Yeah, I'm, yeah I'm, I'm waiting for it. What is this, new attacks? Let me run. I'm gone. You, 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 you've done enough. You've done enough. Every, every time people start talking good about your name, you come through and ruin it, discredit everything they done talked about. You suck. I don't trust you. You don't trust me either. That's why I'm just dipping through your maze. Yep, I'm gone. Yep, maybe next time. Nope, maybe next time. Stop it. You're oh, oh oh good try. Okay, good move. Good move. This dude. I mean she really she really think I'm a killer. What happened to innocent until proven guilty? And why was you talking to my man's papyrus? Did he tell you about his jersey? Huh? He ain't share that with you, huh? We're cool. We're cool. Maybe if you had some screeners, you wouldn't be missing every shot. Ooh, good try. Good try. You getting into your bag right now. I see you. You speeding it up. Nice try. Not enough. Get 360'd on. Oh my gosh. That's what I get. I tried to 360 her and she bodied me. Even my, even my shadow mixing you up. You can't even hit my elongated shadow. Oh gosh, this was the wrong way. Is she gonna cut my path off or is she gonna let me through? Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Thank you, let's talk about it, please. If you don't wanna talk, I'm gonna body you. Unnecessary. I didn't, I didn't provoke this. It sounds like it came from over here. I don't want to... Okay, I'm going to push a button just to... There we go. Oh, you've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up. Ugh, huh? That's a nice name. Thank you. My name is...
if I just woke up, but it was fading to white, wouldn't I, wouldn't that make whatever the person was saying clearer to hear? The waterfall here seems to flow from the ceiling of the cavern. Occasionally, a piece of trash will flow through and fall into the bottomless abyss below. Viewing this endless cycle of worthless garbage, it fills you with determination. Trash zone. Okay. I have a feeling a beat up desktop computer. The inside is empty. I feel like what this game is trying to show me is like humans are the real monsters, regardless of who I'm talking to. And I'm acting like a monster by, by killing other monsters. You know, we waged, we waged war on innocent people. It's a cooler. It has no brand and no, no signs of wear. Inside are a couple of freeze dried space food bars. Take one. What's my health looking like? It's a DVD case for an anime. Desperate claw marks cover the edges. Yeah, some of y'all be like that with that new, uh, with them new anime drops. The new Attack on Titan. Y'all, there's just the claws be on your neck. Y'all addicts. I need that season. I, I don't, I don't watch the show. I'm gonna get into it though. Cause everybody talks about the show like it's just a goat. Seems like a regular training dummy. Do you want to beat it up? No. It's meant for talking. You stare into each other's eyes for a moment. I didn't hit him. What the hell? <laughs> what? So the thing is, another thing I wanted to remember uh, or, or to tell y'all. At the very beginning, remember how I said my file was... Um, I had to start it over. I hit him when I was leaving L'Oreal. Like when L'Oreal taught me, hey, you know, this is for talking, do not hit him. I smacked him and she said, no, those are not for hitting, those are for talking to. I'm trying to see if that's gonna connect to right here, but I think he's just mad I didn't hit him again. <laughs> Too intimidated to fight me. <laughs> I am a ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cousin used to live inside a dummy too. Until. You destroyed their home! Us ghosts spend our whole lives looking for a proper vessel. Slowly, slowly, we grow closer to our new bodies. Until one day, we too may become corporeal beings. Beings able to laugh, love, and dance like any other. But you, my cousin's future, you took it all away. Despicable, despicable, despicable human. I hope you're not too attached to your body because your soul's about to get evicted. Okay. He talked way too much, bro. Those are his fighting words. I'm finna body him. Mad dummy blocks away. Attack 30 defense. Yes, because they're a ghost. Physical attacks will fail. Okay, okay. Oh, wow. Pitiful, pitiful, pitiful. Stop it. Oh, good moves. You got a little shotgun blast from the dome piece. Shooting thoughts at me. I hear you. Oh, okay. Ow, you dummies. Watch where you're aiming your magic attacks. Hey, you, forget I said anything about magic. You are built nasty in a fight. You didn't look like this before. That is a nose, a mouth, and a bone, bro. I'm over here thinking that was a dog. Oh my gosh, that's nasty looking. That's nasty looking. You ain't defeat nobody, bro. Do a, uh, yep, yep, right here. Bow, bow. Mad Dummy is hopping mad. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. No one is happy with this. I'll use your soul to cross the barrier. Get mixed. Nice try. Smells like a clothing store. Um. Okay, so we got him moving now, which is a good sign. I gotta start using some of these, some of these. No, no, I'm gonna save them. I'm gonna save them. I'm gonna need them for, for something, I'm sure. 
I know that hurt. Foolish, foolish, foolish. Even if you attack my vessel, you'll never hurt me. I'm still incorporeal, you dummy. Well, I know what's working. Wait, is dummy a compliment? Yep, I know that mess hurts. I know that mess does not feel good. Nope. Mad Dummy is doing an armless ska dance. Okay, well, armlessly ska this. I'll stand in the window of a... Shut up. Nobody even trying to hear that. Mad Dummy is getting a cotton all over the dialogue. I mean, there's no point in hitting him. I'm gonna just keep trying to talk to him. Then everything I want will be mine! He knows how to get out of the, the, the way. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I know that mess don't feel good. Do you feel like talking now, boy? No, he don't. So I'm gonna keep... I don't even care what you're talking about. What is it gonna take? Maybe, may, maybe. I mean, he seems like he's moving more sporadic. I'm about to just see if this last attack gonna, gonna do the job. Ooh, you ate that. Hey, guys! Dummies, dummies, dummies! Remember how I said not? Oh, I'm sounding like Papyrus. Remember how I said not to shoot at me? Well, Failures, you're fired. You're all being replaced. <laughs> now you'll see my true power. Relying on people that aren't garbage. Mechanical words fill the room. What you talking? Talk to me, bro. Still ain't trying to talk, huh? No one is happy with this, I'm sure. Dummy bots, magic missile. Magic missile this. Ooh, I know that mess hurt. All of them? Mad Dummy glares into a mirror, then turns to you with the same expression. Probably looking at himself like, yo, are these niggas not listening to me, bro? I just hired you. Yeah, bro, don't, don't nobody respect you here. I know I don't. Dummy bots, try again. Good move, good move, good move. Okay, that mess hurt. There we go, we, we, we put some hits on him. He said final attack. Ah! This is what we needed, this is what we needed. This. Oh my gosh. N no way. These guys are even worse than the other guys. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? I don't need friends. Whoa, I've got knives. Bro, you gotta stop. You have to stop. I'm out of knives, but it doesn't matter. You can't hurt me and I can't hurt you. You'll be stuck fighting me forever, forever, forever. <laughs> What, what the heck is this? Uh, acid rain? Oh, forget it. I'm out of here. We really gonna let him leave, huh? <gasps> isn't that, isn't that snap black or block? Um, ab uh, stab, stab nap a look. Sorry, I interrupted you, didn't I? As soon as I came over, your friend immediately left. Oh no, you guys looked like you were having fun. Oh no, I just wanted to say hi. Oh no. Bro, you saved my life. Well, I'm gonna head home now. Oh, um, feel free to come with if you want, but no pressure. I understand if you're busy, it's fine. 
No worries. Bro, then let me go. Go home. Even like, I know worries. Kind of cold down here. You ate lunch yet? You playing Apex Legends later? Like, bro, do you want to stay and hang? It's cool. Just thought I'd offer. Bro, I, I wanted to chill with you still. You know, you know I'm finna chill with you. Hey, my house is up here. In case you want to see. Or in case you don't. Bro, why are you like this? It be people like this that be wanting to hang with me. And I'm like, bro, put some pep in your step. I am a pep stepped dude. Don't come to me with low steps, bro. Pep it up. This little bird wants to carry you across. Accept the bird's offer. Sure. Let's go, duck. Yes. Let's go. Work them wings. Work them wings. Oh, I'm so inspired right now. Thank you, duck. You're the truth. You're the absolute truth. And you're here without your bubble bath. That shows a resilient mind. Thank you, sir. What's even over here? Oh, and we're back. And we're back. So did we go through here at first? No, we did not. We got Rock back in the building with his bicycles. I relocated my store, but there are still no customers. Fortunately, I've thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for a free ice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. I'm cool. Well then, tell your friends, there's an ice cream hidden in the depths of the watery <gasps> cavern. Sorry, I just had a fresh bicycle. Ah. Bicycle sounds like a crazy word. I'm done saying it. There's nothing left over here for me. Chicken, let's go! He's the truth! King! King! I don't know, something about him just just like doing that just like really gets me hype, bro. I don't understand. He's just cool with it. Hold on. Hold on. I don't want no problems. What? 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 It's a living. What are you even doing up here? I'm gonna go visit bro in a sec, but okay, that's definitely his house. I don't know whose other house that was. North, Blook Acres, East, Hotland, to the right or other way or no way at all, Timmy Village. Bro is off some loud banyan to the right. Is that Plankton? Was that me? All right, bro, we out of here. So because Ghost invited us, we gonna we can go to his crib first. What you doing? Downloading MP3s off LimeWire? I'm about to call it. I'm about to get you arrested, bro. Oh, you really came. Sorry, I wasn't expecting that. It's not much, but make yourself at home. What you mean it ain't much, man? You got you got you have stuff in the fridge. Oh. Are you hungry? I can get you something to eat. You don't trust me to, to look in the fridge? What you got in there, human remains? This is a ghost sandwich. Do you want to try it? You attempt to bite into the ghost sandwich. You phase right through it. Oh, never mind. You knew I couldn't get... After a great meal, I like to lie on the ground and feel like garbage. <laughs> I've been there. I've been there. It's a family tradition. Do you want to join me? Bro, no, but I am because because the viewers want me to, dude. Okay. Follow my lead. Here we go. You'll lie down as long as you don't move. So, only move around when you want to get up, I guess. What? 
Whoa! Oh, this is wavy. This look like a adult swim bump. I'm about to use this for uh for video transitions. This is right here just speaks to me on a different level, bro. This isn't feeling like garbage. But I can understand the sentiment cuz cuz follow me with this. Now imagine we are all on planet Earth for a limited amount of time. What you do with that time ultimately defines your place in the history books that only modern men have written prior to the modern man. There was no thoughts. Sure, you had your hieroglyphics. You could tell time through fossils, ancient designs. But these ideas and arithmetic aren't connected with soul beings all the time. What will you do to leave your mark? One day, this YouTube channel will mean nothing but a blip in what was known as the human existence. It means something to us now, sure, but will it stand the test of time? All right, bro. Thank you for that. I appreciate it. That was uh, thoughtful. Well, that was nice. Thank you. That was cool, bro. I, I rock with him. Oh, that's my TV. There's a show I like to watch on it sometimes. Bro, what's it called? Talk to me. The computer's internet browser is open to a music sharing forum. I know it. I know you was on LimeWire. Uh, I'm gonna keep working on that mix CD. Bro, when you get it, when you get it finished, shoot me the link um through Apple Music, Spotify, um any streaming platform. I want I want to take a listen. Would you be writing? This CD is labeled Spook Tunes. Change the title of this. Play it, sure. Why does kind of go hard? Uh, spook tunes. Spook tunes. Spook tunes. Spook tunes. You know I'm playing the spook. You know I'm playing the spook. I can't sing this song. Something about it don't feel right with my spirit. New track, please. This CB, this CD is labeled Spook Wave. <laughs> you play the CD. This is called Spook Wave. Okay, I gotta feel this one. Uh, yeah. Uh, put on that Spook Wave. He say, she say. You know who it be. Real easy, easy gangway. Yeah, you know what it is. My boy, he making them CDs. Uh, he show up spooky. He wanna be he. Uh, you wanna woohoo. No, you don't. That's papyrus. He really was wildin'. Send him to islands. Away from me. I do it so gratefully. Easy gang. Major waves. Uh, major waves. Swimming through pools, you know. Bro, I just wish I could freestyle, man. I just, I don't know, I'll be losing it. This CD is called what? This CD is labeled Ghoulie, Ghoulie Day Music. Oh. Not you doing karaoke on the track. Oh, hell no, nah. turn that off. It's locked. Bro, I'm tired of hearing that. Okay. He really trying to make his own mixtape. You see him, like he was making mixes at the start, but then, on his third album, he's like, let me give it a shot. You gotta respect it, even though I ran out on a track. Doesn't seem like anyone's home. I feel like I feel like I might have killed whoever's home this was. So now I'm starting to understand. You can't just watch the game from the ending if you want to play it again. You gotta take certain routes. Like you gotta see it from the beginning. If you kill everybody, see how the game changes from the beginning. If you save everybody, see how the game... Yeah, I, I get it. I see it. Gary! It's a snail. For some reason, you can't help but wonder what it tastes like. Stop. Snail... Snail, snail. A long journey extends in front of you. 
Snail, snail, reach far. Oh, that's that's him actually translating at the bottom. Reach far and stretch beyond the horizons. So snail sambu. Who is this? Awkward. I'm working right now. I mean, welcome to Blook Family Snail Farm. Yeah, I'm the only employee. This place used to get a lot of business, but our main customer disappeared one day. Now it's just some hairy guy that shows up once a month. Yeah, to, to hit your fucking snails up, bro. Look at him. He's hitting it and now he's just vibing. I've been long overdue for a second house. The snail is counting dollar bills. What is this? Like a snail um Playboy's mansion? A snail um bunny ranch? Like this man is in a suit and tie too, so you know he got some kind of coin. He come here to this farm to wow out, bro, with snails. I'm out of here. It's like it's like snail peyote, bro. Do you want to play a game? Oh, sorry. Do you want to play a game? It's called Thunder Snail. Snails will race, and if the yellow snail wins, you win. It's 10 G's to play. Okay, press Z repeatedly to encourage your snail. Ready? Yeah, I'm about to body this. Smash X all day, bro. Oh my gosh. Hurry up! Bro, he's getting nervous. This is bull. You played me. Oh, looks like you encouraged your snail too much. All that pressure to succeed really got to her. Oh, you played me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go lighter then. I'm gonna go lighter then. You doing great. Yep, you bodying this. Yep, keep it up. Keep it up. You doing good. Why are you the only one with shades on, but you're in last? That's like niggas that come into in a court with with Steph Curry everything on. Come on, bro. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. What are you slowing down for? Oh my gosh. Whatever, whatever. How do you even win this? Bro, you're you're running a you're running a gimmick here. I'm not gonna encourage her at all. I'm about to lose. I'm about to lose and I'm the only one with gear on. It's it's just corny. So what's your excuse now, Snap? Oh, you both tried your best. But the snail looks discouraged. Her best wasn't good enough. Oh. You're lucky I got all these coins, bro. That looked like winter speed right there. I'm trying to use my, my eyes and my, and my, you know. There you go. There you go. There you go. That looked like winter speed. That looked like winter speed. It's hard to tell. It's hard. To, I know I did better, though. Yo, yellow snail, go back to school. Like you just out here running scams on people. That's that's garbage, bro. Do not rock with that at all. Oh, who is this, bro? Granddad from Family Guy, pervert ass, bro. Oh my gosh. I shouldn't be even talking mess about him because he's the happiest critter after Dino Kid. Like. This dude loving life right now. No teeth, one eye. You can't tell him nothing. Resilient mind. Whoa there. I've got some neat chunk for sale. Like what, bro? Heels looks like a crab. I don't want any of this. You don't have nothing for me. Where am I? I've been around a long time. Maybe too long. Studying history sure is easy when you've lived through so much of it yourself. <laughs> you know he got a nasty old man laugh. Eh? You don't know what that is. What are they teaching you kids in school nowadays? <laughs> the 
that's the Delta Rune, the emblem of our kingdom. The kingdom of monsters. <laughs> Great name, huh? It's as I always say. Oh, King Fluffy Buns, cat name for beans. Emblems meaning no. That emblem actually predates written history. The original meaning has been lost to time. All we know is that the triangle symbolizes us monsters below, and the winged circles above symbolizes something else. Most people say it's the angel from the prophecy. <laughs> excuse me, excuse me. I'm gonna. Golly! I'm getting hit from both sides. Like, let me order some, some dinner real quick. It's getting late. And before I get into this game, look, if you have a Dairy Queen near where you live, I need you to try something. Go there, order the dude sandwich. It is a country fried chicken sandwich that I mean, I had it one time. That needs to be in the conversation of excellent chicken sandwiches. Berlizzi put you on first. The prophecy, let's talk about it, old man. Oh yeah, the prophecy. Legend has it, an angel who has seen the surface will descend from above and bring us freedom. That's me! Lately, the people have been taking a bleaker outlook, calling that winged circle the angel of death. Oh, because I've been killing people. A harbinger of destruction waiting to free us from this immortal realm. In my opinion, when I see that little circle, I just think it looks neat. <laughs> Talk about King King Fluffy Buns. He's a friendly, happy-go-lucky kind of guy. If you keep walking around long enough, you'll probably meet him. He loves to walk around and talk to people. Eh? Why do I call Dreamer Fluffy Buns? Oh, that's a great story. I don't remember it. But if you come back much later, I'm sure I'll have remembered by then. Talk, tell me about Undyne, if they're two different people. Good to know. Undyne. Yeah, she's, she's a local hero around here. Through grit and determination alone, she fought her way to the top of the Royal Guard. That makes more sense now when it comes to Papyrus kind of sucking up to her. Actually, she just came through here asking about someone who looked just like you. I'd watch your back, kid. And buy some items. It might just save your hide. <laughs> Be careful out there, kid. Bro, he's talking about Undyne as if I don't have a choice but to smack her up, bro. And I don't want to have to do that, but like, I will. I'm gonna hit her with this. Well, I'm hit her with a um with a ballet tutu kick. What do you think I'm gonna hit her with? A body here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me check this out. Hurt, beaten, and fearful for our lives, we surrendered to the humans. Seven of their greatest magicians sealed us underground with a magic spell. Anything can enter through the seal, but only beings with a powerful soul can leave. Hmm. There is only one way to reverse the spell. If a huge power, equivalent to seven human souls, attacks the barrier, it will be destroyed. All right. All right, can't can't go around. Nope. Okay. But this cursed place has no entrances or exits. There is no way a human could come here. We will remain trapped down here forever. Special enemy Temmy appears here to defeat you. Why is he shaking like that? Breathe, bro. Rated 10 out of 10. Okay. Loves to pet cute humans, but you're allergic. Oh, I'm Temmy. Oh, Whoa! Nasty ad nasty ass attack. And it still worked. Timmy vibrates intensely. Yeah, I'm gonna hold on, I wanna learn more about you. Timmy only wants the Timmy flakes. No! So hungry dies. This is nasty. This is that's kind of unfair, bro. Timmy is trying to glomp you. I mean, I could leave, but I'm kind of intrigued. You say hello to Timmy. Oh, I'm Timmy. Oh, 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 I'm Timmy. Oh, oh. You are a weirdo. 
You flex it, Temmie. No, muscles are not cute. Oh, I have to disagree. No! Just the two of us, huh? Bro, you really snuck up in third party for what? That's the thing, like people who be in the gym like this, like flexed up, muscled up. Oh, excellent. They only want to do it to other flexors, bro. Like y'all live in your own muscled up flex world and I want to be a part of it. A nigga can't lose his gut though. That's why I'm hating a little. I'm gonna lose it though. Then I'm gonna be right there flexing with y'all. The bruise and the girls. <laughs> the bruise and the eggs, yeah. And for the record, I did not come up with the name Egg. I think I said it once and y'all stuck with it. That's how, that's how it worked. What's up with you? Mold Small is having a quiet time. Flirt with her. You wiggle your hips suddenly. I ain't never seen you do this. I ain't never seen you do this. What? Whoa. Smells like a bait shop. Mold, mold bug. This, that made me itch. My arm is itching now looking at this. Hug him. You hug moldy bug. Gross slime covers you. Your speed decreases. Man, get mixed. You lie down. Moldy bug lies down too. Mold bug understands life now. Then why are you still trying to kill me? What does it take for you to leave? I don't want to be known as a harbor of destruction, bro. Unhug him. You don't hug mold bug. It appreciates your respect of its boundaries. So this game understands boundaries and still have a pirate doing what he was doing, huh? Cause Lord knows I was not feeling that. Oh, we out of here. You know, I rock with it. Hold on, bro. Something tells me I'm I'm missing something unless this just opened up. Here we go. Yep. We in there. We in there. We in there gamers. We in there gamers. No, let, let, let's let's leave that on. Without candles or magic to guide them home, the monsters use crystals to navigate. We in there. Crystal gang. Yep. Put them lanterns on. You thought Undyne I wasn't going to plead my case? I'm one of the good guys. Watch, watch how I spare this. Oh, I know exactly what to do. Clean yourself. Yep. It hops around excitedly. Absolutely. Yep. Yep. Oh, throw a green one my way. Yep. Good looks. One HP up. Let's get it. Yep. You can leave. And then we got bro one in a... Wanting to like swag out on us, bro. Dripping, bro. Yep. Let, let, let's let's flex then. Ooh. And just like that, I'm out of here. Hmm. Okay, okay. I don't see any more um candles. Let's turn this bad boy on. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Navigated. What we need though. Okay, nice. I was gonna need a wa a boat or something. A little skim board. We in here though. Behind you. Oh gosh. We got to fight. We got to fight. It's time. It's time. It's been time. You've been following me this whole time, bro. I heard I was talking to uh Franklin the Turtle. He told me you was looking for me, bro. Seven. Seven. Seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king 
King Asgore Dreamer will become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface back from humanity and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured. Understand, human? This is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. Oh. What's up? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I wasn't even thinking about Lil Bro anymore. And here he come out to cut. I'm talking about, I'm dying. <laughs> I'll help you fight. It's me, right? Yo! You did it! Undyne is right in front of you! You've got front row seats to see her fight! Oh, f***! <laughs> Why you look at the camera like, you look at the camera like, Oh, f***! <gasps> Wait. <sighs> Who is she fighting? about this are you <laughs> look at him happy to get tattled on i'm out of here bro hold on hold on you got any, anything else to say you weren't going to <laughs> okay bro get me out of here nope i'm, I'm cutting up yep i'm out of here bro you hear a passing conversation hmm if i say my wish you promise okay no we heard this yep okay we get him in order right now Someday I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under, okay? Standing under the sky, looking at the world all around. That's my wish. You hear laughter. Hey, you said you wouldn't laugh at it. You hear a passing conversation. Sorry, it's just funny. That's my wish too. However, there is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface, they will return. The underground will go empty. This is like three different games. If you do it, neutral, pa uh, pacifist, or genocide. I'm already knowing. I feel like a lot of this dialogue will be different. It's got to be Lil Bro. Yo! Yo, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but <laughs> I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, you're human, right? <laughs> Man, I knew it! <laughs> well, I, I know it now, I mean. <laughs> Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. <laughs> so, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something. But I kind of stink at that. <laughs> Yo, say something mean so I can hate you. And that's, that's, that's where it come down to. Let's talk about racism. Let's talk about homophobia, transphobia. Ain't even no real reason to be having these negative opinions towards a group of people, bro. Especially in 2021. Like, I understand that there was, there was things done in the past that, you know, we can only hope to, to fix moving forward in life. We can only hope to undo and rebuild. But we really walking around hating each other for things that, like, are either out of our control or have nothing to do with us. Why the fuck do we care? Look at my nigga Dino Kid. Begging me to diss him so he can have a reason not to like me because he know deep down he f 
with me. I have what I'm told. I do. So what? Please? Nah, homie. I can't do that to you, bro. Yo, what? So I have to do it? Here goes nothing. Yo, I... I hate your guts. Man, I... I'm such a turd. Um... I'm good. I'm gonna go home now. Yo, wait! Help! I tripped! Oh, that was a bridge falling down. No, you don't. I'm finna help him. Move. She saw me help him. She saw me help him. Yo, yo, dude. If, if you... Oh, this is fire character development, though. If, if you, you... If you want to hurt my friend, you're going to have to get through me first. Oh, my little heart. Uh. No way he just stood up for me like that. She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin. <laughs> Guess being enemies was just a nice thought. <laughs> <laughs> huh. We'll just have to be friends instead. <laughs> Man, I should really go home. I mean, by the time I get home, I'm finna be dino bacon when my mom catches me, bro. She finna beat my ass and turn it into literal bacon, bro. That's gonna be my wounds healing is bacon, bro. I bet my parents are worried sick about me. Later, dude. I love Dino Kid. All right. Oh, wow. Seven. 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 Seven human souls. And King Asgore will become a god. Six. That's how many we've collected thus far. Understand. Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as is customary for those who make it this far. I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. Thank you. No, I'm here for it. Don't don't wait. Tell me. I'm I'm intrigued. No, you know what? Why should I tell that story when you're about to die? Oh, what's the deal? You! You're standing in the way of everybody's hopes and dreams! You look crazy. Alfie's history books made me think humans were compassionate. But you! You're just a remorseless criminal! You wander through the caverns, attacking anyone in your path! Self-defense? Please. You didn't kill them because you had to. You killed them because it was easy for you. Because it was fun for you. Do you think it was fun when I found out? Doggo, who always made me laugh, ooh, was dead because of the whims of a single human? No, but your time's up, villain. You won't hurt anyone else. A knight in shining armor has appeared. And all the pain you inflicted on the fallen, every hope, every dream you've turned to dust, she's gonna send right back through her spear. Ah! I'll show you how determined monsters truly are. Come on, step forward and let's end this. Oh my God, electrifying speech. The wind is howling. You're filled with determination. 
And just like that, I'm going to grab you and make you wait till next episode, ladies and gentlemen. I know you're sitting there like, but we really want to see. <laughs> so they're grabbing you by the collar like, no, wait. Till next time. <laughs> but lazy, but why? That is hilarious, bro. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to end the episode for today right there. I hope that you are enjoying this playthrough. It's a, it's a nice story. I'm loving the way that this story is turning out. Very thoughtful, very unique. I'm loving this, bro. I can see why this is a cool. Where you going, Desk? I can see why this is a cult classic, bro. But with that being said, if you enjoyed this video and want to see this series continue, make sure you slap a like on this video. Subscribe if you are new. Hit that bell so you always know when I'm posting more vids. I love y'all, bro. Excuse me. And I will see you in the next video on Dine. I'm coming for you. Peace, y'all.